Hey guys, welcome back to another speed build. And today I'm going to try to build a build for my speed, uh, legacy challenge. And so let me use this random color generator, which will generate the color of this generation. And it seems like it's going to be blue. So yeah, without further ado, let's go build my uh, house for the legacy challenge. So like in any old speed builds, I'm going to start by placing walls and building the shell of the build. So yeah, so right now I'm placing two bedrooms on each side. I actually, again, like a lot of builds I'm doing at this moment because I'm not really good with shells. It's just following the same floor. I'm um, just finding a shelf or like a floor plan. So I'm actually using one. If you want to use, use the link for this floor plan is going to be in the description. So yeah, that's the living room and the dining room, and this is like the master bedroom with the ensuite, and that's the open floor plan, and there's a kitchen there, kind of bumped out there. Yeah, it's all open. Just the... And yeah, so there's the porch on either end. This one, is, it's more like rounded. like It's more like an oval than a circular like that, I guess, inward. But I mean, that, that one looks, it looks fine. And then it, it changes a bit later because the shape, I mean, the size of this build changes. But yeah... I mean, I like, I do that, but it doesn't give that vibe, so I'm like, it looks, I'm just going to do it all circular, or like half circular and do that, that, that. and it looks cool, it's, it's a new style, but yeah. So I'm just like trying to look for a front door that's like only one wide, because I don't want a double door. So yeah, I put that one, I do change that, I, I just put that, I tried to use this one, it's too big, so I'm like, but I'll just come back to that, yeah, so I do... Again, I changed it bigger and smaller, but yeah. So there's the, the like double window will change, and I don't use that window. I think I change it to another. Oh, and I sorry about that. Yeah. So yeah, I, that that will happen a few times. I I should have edited it, but I mean, ah, too many feet, I guess. But yeah, so I'm just doing the same thing back here, or like fixing it after I resized it. So yeah, I'm just putting the uh, filler lights so you can actually see what I'm building. I I just and there's love seats. Uh, I don't know if I keep them. I mean, obviously, I should, if I were to keep them, I have to keep them for this bill forever. But I mean, anyway. So there's that. I might sell the one that's more inwards. I'll keep the two, like one by the window and one in the back, but not the one side, because. And I might change it. I don't know. I'll think about it. But yeah, so. All these are either filler or they stay. I think I might have accidentally kept that TV stand, but I mean, I think it's fine. Simple. So yeah, and I'm, I do actually not, oh, I, the thing is I like this, the current swatch isn't going to stay, even though that's technically the swatch that I got from the, the random, but I mean, yeah. And that's the table. I, I first use it, It'll change as well. I don't like because I, I don't like that. It, it just yeah, and that happened again. I keep accidentally pressing F one instead of escape, which obviously is like leaving. I mean, going to the manage world world mode. So yeah, and so I'm yeah, now reshaping it because it's, the living room is too big. I don't like it. <sighs> Sorry for uh, I should have blown my nose before I do this. And yeah, so I change it to the cat and dog windows and. Those, which I like a lot better. And yeah, I'm just like trying to center that table with that uh, back door. And yeah, I this is going to change. Or at least, actually, no, I, I don't know what the chair is, what happened. I, I know that I definitely know I changed the table, I'm pretty sure. And yeah, I'm at blue doors because this legacy like, challenge, or well, at least this first generation, is going to be blue. It has to be all blue. Or at least, I, I I mean, I don't know if I'm supposed to have blue furniture, but I mean, I'm just going to follow, I'm just trying to follow the thing. And yeah. Yeah, there's the kitchen, and there's a door, back, a side door, I think. Yes. And yeah, so we just add some blue furnitures, which I like, actually. And that sink also changes to the actual sink that the... Uh, cottage living comes with 
Yeah, and this time <laughs> for once I actually didn't use a hood because I feel like it looked weird because apparently the floor plan has the kind of thing there. Oh yeah, and I <laughs> scoot this back because it's again it's too big. I don't like that big. It feels too open, I guess. If that makes sense. I do close it a little bit, but anyway, I scoot it because then it ha helps the kitchen kind of more nice, looks nicer, rounded. And yes, yeah, so I had more windows to back, which we're supposed to be in yet. So and uh, yeah, I scoot that table a lot. <laughs> so yeah, that I'm now furnishing the bathroom. Apparently, there's a kind of a jacuzzi bath up there, so I'm just going to do that. That's what it's, it's like exactly same shape as that. And yeah, so there's a sink there and that, and yeah, that's where I changed the sink, to that one. And yeah, I'm now back, and oh, and I realized it doesn't fit there, it's like random, so I choose a different one. And that one has a similar color to the toilet, so I use that. And but then I changed again, that one also has similar, so it's fine. And now it's the kid's bedroom, which, I mean, technically since I'm just starting, technically he won't have any kids, but I mean, it's for future proofing it. So yeah, it is a he, just saying. My, at least my first sim will be a he. So yeah, and I'm just adding a lot of windows. These will... I don't know if I did in this uh, during the speed build. I, I, but these don't stay. They, it'll be all single paneled instead of double paneled in every room. Because after a while I bet that doesn't look right. It's too much windows. So I, I changed that. But anyway, so now we're... Um, furnishing the master bedroom. Also, for some reason, I forget to furnish the ensuite. So I do that after in my touring part, as you'll see. But yeah, so I'm just decorating. And yeah, I'm also adding some. And, I, and I'm like, this is too big for one bed. So I put two beds, so it's like, it'll be two children, I'm thinking. And yeah, that's just, and I, yeah, I think I like the layout. And yeah, so originally this is like another big bedroom. I'm like, at the moment it's first gen. There's not going to be much Sims, so I'm like, this could be like an office. Uh, and yeah, and I'm like, I um, yeah, and this is I'm just like decorating it right now. It's not much. I do have a few more things, but I mean, as time goes, I might add more things. But yeah, like there I changed the table. It looks a lot better, I think. And yeah, I add wooden chairs which looks more cozier and I just add that painting which I use in every build but it looks so nice I, I love that painting it's like my, one of my favorite yet yeah. and so I use that kind of and yeah I, apparently it was dark there so I put another light there <sighs> sorry again for the nose but yeah and I try to find blue swatches and, that, and yeah I'm also adding some rug there not that one but yeah this one not bad and now, now I add, I think, and you know, soon I do the floor, I think. Yeah, I changed that. It's a bit bluey, I think. And yeah, I, that's, I wanted to keep that blue. It's like kind of that blue. And so yeah, I'm, I scoot it so it's more central, more nice. Yeah. And I think I like that swatch, that light, light blue color is so good. But yeah, I try to move around, make it look blue. I also try to put oh yeah so that's that but I also try to put runners that always don't work I use this one I put it like and then like it doesn't it's like weird one's like filled up and one's not so I use another one and I add that one and like maybe I should add like a circular log in the center I'm like oh well let me first yeah but yeah but I'm like no that's I don't like it so I'm just going to do the floors first yep yeah. there me goes with the cats and dogs wooden floor which this one is actually really nice I mean. Second to that other one I was trying to use. See, so yeah, I use that. I th oh, ah, that's why I'm, I'm probably going to add a coat rack in the front too. I do have a kind of empty space after I kind of scoot that thing. But yeah, I mean, the vibe is like that with the kind of panel on the bottom and kind of plaster on top. But I just use that blue panel, which I actually change again later. But yeah, so I use a bit of different tile for once in this house. I try to find a similar swatch to that, couldn't find it. I loved it, so I, I'm like, like always, I use these kind of columns to kind of divide it, in a sense. It's kind of like, it's as if it's purposely there to kind of divide the room. So yeah, and I like changing again, it's like, I don't like this color, I'm like, I want to have, make, and I decide to like, have a wall that kind of divides it, and I used the uh, cats and dogs, which I also love to use. 
which also is like really good. And I and I remove those columns there because it's not necessary anymore. Then I was originally gonna do the beam, but like this also looks nice. So yeah, I'm just getting another color, and this one also is like lighter, but I like it. I think, but I don't oh, know. I actually changed that one to another one because all the other rooms have white. But this one has brown, so it doesn't make sense. I like the trim. I mean, and yeah, I did the now I finally start adding a bit more stuff like lights. And yeah, I've just scoot those to make more sense. And and uh, I don't know if I I know I put paintings there yet. Yeah, there I change it to white so it makes sense. That's all cohesive. And yeah, and yeah, there goes me putting more painting. I always use that farm painting. I really love that one. But yeah, so um, yeah, now I'm going to the roofing part. <laughs> I'm going all everywhere. So yeah, there's a gable roof here. And then there's another gable roof behind it. Kind of like a double and I do and I change the height so it's better. And yeah, there's another one here, but it's a more lower than this one, so yeah, I do that. And then uh, I forgot where I happened here. There's an oh yeah, and I decided to use two different pieces so that that doesn't clip there. So yep, yeah, I'm just changing changing that. And yeah, and there's another. <laughs> this is full of gable roofs. And yeah, so it's like here and there and here and there. Yep. Yeah, so that's that. And actually, oh no, there's gonna be more roofing because uh yeah, you'll see, you'll see why. But yeah, this is the house portion of it. And yeah, uh, yeah, and then I there's another there's on the on top of the porch. Uh, yeah, I just add the roofing. I didn't really need to, but I just do that for my sake, I guess. And yeah, there's like a roof over this front porch. It's smaller, so I just decrease the size on top. And yeah, the thing is, it's supposed to be this panel, like um, metal paneling, but it's blue, like baby bluish. But I didn't like that, and I don't like any other swatches, so I'm like, I'm struggling because because the paneling currently is like darkish, the top has to be not. I don't know, light? But it doesn't make sense. I, so I I try to use a different paneling. Uh, I don't know if it's that one. Yeah, I think maybe that was the one I used. Yeah, and I, now I'm... Yeah, I guess it is. And so yeah, I used that. Uh, I don't know if I... No, maybe I... No, actually, never mind. So yeah, I decided to use a lighter color, which is... Then I can use a dark roof, and it's kind of contrasting, which is a lot prettier, in my opinion. Yeah, so I just like... I think that's a blue swatch, but... Yeah, and yeah, so it's matching. So I use that column because in the image there's like a column, but I add something to that later. But yeah, so now I tiling the bathroom with that blue, and then I mean it's not the perfect, but I mean I like it. It's okay. It's like white on blue. And yeah, I think I yeah I changed it. So yeah, I changed it to lighter color for that, even though it's not necessarily the best best. But yeah, I add a mirror. I don't know why I was saying window for a sec, but yeah, it's a mirror. And yeah, I changed the light now here. I think I changed the rest of the lights here too. Yeah, I used that here because it looks nice, I think. I used that throughout the whole office and bedroom, I think. Yeah. Oh, sorry, and that happened again. <laughs> and yeah, I'm back. So yeah, I'm removing those lights, adding those. And I use a, the, I first used that one. I want those kind of long ones. And yeah, this is where I add the island. It looks fitting, so I put those. And yeah. I wanted a long one, but like that cat's and I think that's the cat's and dog. Yeah, the light looks nice. And yeah, so and there's a bathroom there. And I use a different light. It's like a more of a conish shape light, which is I think is a base game. But yeah. And yeah, I just scoot <laughs> multiple times. I think it's better now. It's like center to the arch. And yeah, I moved the house because there's actually a garage there. I actually don't realize it here, but at the end, I don't know. If I don't know if I show it in the video, but I do actually rotate this lot because apparently what I thought was the front was actually a side and what I thought was the garage where my garage is facing or like kind of where my garage is overall in this lot is like the side, but that's the front so I had to rotate it, which that makes sense. Yeah, and so I'm fixing this, multiple parts, so that it's like you don't see this Gable, I mean this weird, no. but then it actually looks like that in the actual image, so I mean, I'm happy with that. 
So yeah, I had the same. Oh yeah, so as you can see, I kind of overlap two different columns, like one from the season with that stony base, and obviously that that round column, which looks nice, and it actually matches the image. So yeah, I'm adding these kind of planter boxes, which right now, uh, actually, oh, <laughs> I actually see this weird thing where, oh, yeah, it's, I mean, in this planter, yeah, you can kind of see it now, like your bottom, yeah, you can see it here. <laughs> Apparently, <laughs> I think that's like the generic. Uh, base pauses that apparently, but yeah, I look in the debug. I love this one; it's floaty, but if you actually cover it good enough, it looks as if it's like bush on top of it, and size down. Yeah, it's perfect, and I just put it there. It looks so well; like it, it's just, it looks as if it's meant to be. So yeah, and I put these sidewalk uh, pavement tiles, which actually looks lovely here, and I use the. Kind of a, those low fence that sad too bad it doesn't go to the edge of the lot because it's like it's edge of lot you're not allowed to put fences there so yeah but it looks nice just pretend it goes all the way to the end okay and yeah so I'm fixing those porches and I put stairs which matches the stone so it's fine and I'm just looking for a fence. And I do the same fence on the back. See? Yeah. I originally do that, but I'm like, I'm not going to roof this, so I'm just going to remove that side. I mean, I might as well remove the whole thing, but I mean, I'm just going to keep that. And then I put this blue tall backyard gate, I mean, not gate, um, fence. And I put this, apparently, this doesn't have a matching gate, so I just use that one, which looks similar. I mean, I was trying to look for another one, but that one was the best I could do. But yeah, it looks nice. And then I just add that extra bit. I might like change that so it's like too wide. So it looks nice. And it, this path does follow to the backyard. All the way to the back stairs. And yeah, um, and I'm just adding more greenery. I, I used that, but I changed that to this planter box, which goes well on the wall lovely so I use that and I'm now just like landscaping adding few trees I don't do much in the back I only add trees in the back and then I, I mean I tried using that planter it doesn't fit so yeah I'm just like looking for different trees at first I use that and uh, it doesn't fit and it's like too big so I removed that and use that smaller one which looks nicer obviously debug you can't actually select it the selector tool <laughs> and there was those weird city leaving. Oh, and yeah, I'm just looking for another tree that will fit on the other side because it looks a bit empty. So yeah, I use the same one, just rotate it differently. Add another one near the garage area because I mean, I don't need. I mean, it's a fake garage anyway. But yeah, I mean, I could probably instead of. I mean, I, I'm going. I eternally put that pickup truck, which also was in the image. But I might just like put it off to off to the side, and maybe I'll put something else on. And maybe instead of a car, maybe they decide to put, uh, or the person who lives, the sim, will have gym there. I don't know why. Or maybe like pet stuff, because I'm, I'm thinking this this uh, guy, because he's also, this, oh, I'll just explain briefly. Like, he's a pet he's a pet lover, or like an animal lover. And his aspiration is related to animals, so I'm like thinking maybe he's a, he has like some pet equipment back there as well. He really loves pets, but yeah. So I'm just adding more detail on the outside, and I'm also fixing that roof. And then just yeah, and then there's this smaller bit. I just decided to extend it to the back. It looks nicer there. So yeah, and I'm just doing some finishing touches. Yeah, the oh yeah, and there's the that kind of bump out. Apparently, it's also stone. Okay, I don't... so we're back. And so actually, the, this is my. Legacy Challenge Sim, well, my first generation. I'll explain more of it in my next actual Let's Play series. Oh, just a second. I, I seem to forget this always in every build. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just, and also, I should probably put that, but uh, I should put it. Uh, I always use this one, but maybe I'll just use a regular one. And. And put it in that post. Well, oh, I said in that post, but uh, maybe 
Maybe a gray one, whatever. I don't know. Or just a white one, I guess, will work. And and else I think I forgot a trash can, which I'm actually going to put it here. Hopefully they can access that. I think it should be fine. Oh, did I? Wait, let me ask me. Oh, yeah, it is here. Let's now go back into live view mode. It's more easier to see. So, yeah. Uh, so, this. Well, let me put it up. So, yeah, that's the porch. There we go. And right up, right into it, there's kind of a small entry. I might decorate more. I'll have to obviously put more stuff as time goes. And I might. Let's go to a bit, or I don't know, I'll just see. And yes, there's kind of a, I, could also, I might also change that, but I don't know, whatever. So yeah, this is like the living space. Let's put that wall down. So yeah, that's the living space with a lot of soul. I might actually move this one. It's kind of too crowded. It feels, I wish it was a bit shorter, but I, I like that color, so I'm, I don't know. I'll keep that, let me see. Uh, and then that's the master bedroom. Oh, pfft. Apparently I forgot to. Okay, uh, let's do that now. Now that we, I well, now that I realized it's not furnished. Well, actually, the thing is, this is not fully. Man, it's weird how all the builds I've seen, for some reason, oh, has like a art tray. F oh, from the bathroom to it. But I'm actually not going to do that. Or once I'm actually just going to do it from there. Uh, I'm actually gonna use this dresser. It's a walk-in closet. That, uh, hopefully that's what I wanted. Um, uh, actually, I mean, I'm gonna follow the floor plan that was originally there. It's just a six. So yeah, so they have a they have a sink here. They have a toilet here, and they actually have a bathtub. So I'm just gonna use this. But they have the oh, <laughs> I don't like it. But I mean, it's the blue, and I like it. <laughs> that doesn't even make sense. But anyway, so yeah, let's. Uh, oh, since I'm here, I might as well actually a bit more. Uh, add a bit, a few more stuff. It's just to be just touring, but apparently I need someone. Oh yeah, also I forgot. Uh, 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 Oh yeah, uh, I mean, we don't have a pet yet, I think. I'm starting with just a sim, but I'm just going to adopt a pet. It's probably a cat. But yes, that's toilet. Let me just get the last bit. The source, it's called. Uh, I think it's, yep, there. And now, finally, let's go back. So yeah, that, I mean, anyway. So that's the master bedroom with its on suite. Wish that this was just plain blue, but oh well. It's what it is. And that's... Obviously, the sink and the toilet. Um, yeah, and then there's like a walk in closet. In the floor plan, it's actually the walk in closet is from the bathroom, but. And it happened. Funnily, it's also happened in my other build, my mansion, McMansion build. But I, this time I want to. I want. I feel like it's more natural that it's directly off of the bedroom. So yeah, I just did that with another closet, which I mean, there's two closets. But whatever. Just for the design. But yeah. And then there's a kind of a weird hallway space with a bit of a kitchen. With this island wasn't in the picture, but I, well, I think I guess it's there. And anyway, so yeah. And then there's the cat or yeah, a pet items there. There is also an office. This used to be a bedroom. But I'm going to use as an office. And there's a cat tree, and there's some cat toy box. And then this is another, no, this is a, the main bathroom. And then there's like a kid's bedroom. But obviously this is the first gen I'm going to play with. So right now there won't be anyone. But yeah, so that's about it. I mean, in the backyard, I mean, I didn't do any, any landscaping other than a few stuff. And I mean, I'll probably do more as time goes. Maybe I'll add off camera possibly. But yeah, I don't know. that's about it with all this. I, I actually really love this. Kind of cozy suburban style house and this one is also in Riddleton Bay I recently just like this neighborhood I don't know about the build itself building on it so but I mean it's fine anyway thank you guys for watching don't forget to like and subscribe and see you guys in the next video we'll actually play the legacy challenge